Hi, I'm Kerrigan, and this is my wife, Madeline, and we've been going to Capital, well, almost completely differently. I've been going to Capital for almost seven years now, and you've been at Capital. I've been for... there my whole life, basically grew up in the church. And so I started going to Capital in around 2015. I was uh, invited to a place called Generation Church downtown, uh, now called Capital Young Adults. I started going there because I was invited by a good friend of mine uh, who I went to high school with named Chris Orca. And Chris was a big part of my story because he was so relentless in getting me to Capital Church. And so I started going to, to GCD, which was called at the time, and I just absolutely loved it. Uh, there wasn't a place that I felt more accepted at where I was like, what is happening here? Um, because I did grow up LDS. And so growing up LDS, I felt um, kind of burned by the church in a lot of ways growing up. I was a little skeptical and I was like, what, what am I getting myself into? And as I went there, I just felt this place of home almost. And I remember Chris saying, hey man, I, I really believe that you should pray about doing the internship at Capitol. And I was like, man, I have my dream job. I don't want to give up, give up that for, for interns. And so uh, long story short, uh, God got a hold of my heart and that next week, I met with Pastor Shane about doing interns. And from GCD to Capital to doing interns was only about a week. Um, and so from then, I started serving in the, in the kids' ministry. And I didn't realize that, man, these kids are the future. These kids are world changers. And um, there's so much that God was doing in them um, that I was just so grateful to be a part of it. So I started to be a part of Capital Kids for, for about two years. And then my story is a little bit different. I actually grew up here. Um, my family has been very involved in the church for as long as I can remember. I've been here my whole life, so I think I've probably attended every event and every service that there has been. My family always, um, especially my parents, they always made it a priority that we weren't just going to attend church, but we were also going to be involved by serving. I think growing up, that kept me so rooted and grounded. And I just look back now and think, had I not had that, and had I not had parents that really instilled that in me, I almost wonder where I would be now because it truly did keep me so grounded, especially growing up um, in, in the worlds we live in now. There's so much going on that the church really helps me to stay grounded and just plugged in and rooted here. And I'm so grateful for that. And I just wonder where on earth I would be had I not had this church. So the coolest part for us is that the same place that we were serving God for me full circle, meeting my spouse and the person I want to spend the rest of my life with at Capital Church, I just think is the coolest thing. Um, so in 2017, then we were asked, an opening came up that we were uh, to take over the children's ministry, which was such uh, a scary honor um, after serving for two years in Capital Kids. Yeah, so it was crazy because in February we got engaged and then it was like a week later that we started in kids ministry. So it was planning a wedding and then learning to do ministry together all at once, which was a blast. Um, and I can't believe now it's been almost five years of doing it, which is crazy. Um, and we've just loved it. We always say in Capital Kids that every child and every person um, was created on purpose and for a purpose. And I think that's really cool about kids ministry is that it's so back to the basics of, hey, Jesus loves you and he has a plan for your life. And for Kerrigan and I both, I know we feel so honored to be here and to have served with these kids for so long and just to be a part of this church community and especially a church that really does care about kids and believe in them. And we're just so grateful for everyone here in our yeah. community here. We love Capital Church. <laughs>